we want to solve the trig equation graphically using a graphing calculator. We want to give the first two positive radian solutions rounded to four decimal places. So to solve this graphically, we'll enter the left side of the equation in y1, we'll enter the right side of the equation in y2. And then we'll find the first positive x values where the two graphs intersect. We first want to verify that we are in radian mode, so we'll press the mode key. Notice how right now the calculator is in degree mode, so we'll arrow down to the third row and press enter when the cursor is blinking on radian. And now the calculator is in radian mode, so we'll press y equals, clear any old functions out, so clear, enter, clear, go back up to y1, and we'll enter two sine x, minus six cosine x. So there's the left side in y1, we'll press enter. y2 is equal to five. And now we'll adjust the window, so let's press the window key. Notice here we have the standard window, which is probably fine. But let's go ahead and change the x min and x max to go from negative seven to positive seven. And then we know the y max must go at least to five. Let's go ahead and change the y min and y max to go from negative seven to positive seven as well. And we can always come back and change this if we need to. Now let's go ahead and press graph. There's a graph of y1. And there's a graph of y2. The first two positive solutions would be the x-coordinate of this point of intersection and the x-coordinate of this point of intersection. To determine the points of intersection, we'll press second trace for the calculation menu, and then option five for intersection. So we'll press five, and now we want to move the cursor closest to the point we want to find first. Let's find the least positive solution first, that's approximately here, and now because we only have two curves graphed, we can simply press enter three times. So enter, enter, enter. Our first positive radian solution is approximately 2.1608 radians. Notice that this x value, y is equal to five. So again, our first solution is x is approximately 2.1608 radians. We'll call this x sub one, and now we'll find x sub two, the second positive radian solution, would be the x-coordinate of this point of intersection, so we'll press second trace again for the calculation menu, option five for intersection, and now we'll move the cursor closer to the next point of intersection, which would be somewhere in here. And again, we'll press enter three times. Enter, enter, enter. So the second positive radian solution would be approximately 3.4789 radians. These would be the first two positive radian solutions to the given trig equation. Going back to the graph just for a moment, because these graphs continue to the left and right forever, notice how there would be an infinite number of solutions to this equation. I hope you found this helpful.